so much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Did you see what I'm holding? Yeah, a guitar. A really small guitar. I know it's a guitar because it has six strings. Looks like a ukulele, but it's a guitar. <laughs> All right, let's set that down right there because you and I are gonna draw a guitar together today. Okay, let's start with the color blue. Well, actually, let's be creative. That guitar is blue, so let's use green. <laughs> you can use any color you want. So I'm gonna draw the body of the guitar. Let's go like this. Whoa, yeah, whoa, whoa. What a cool shape, wow. And hard rocker guitars can have crazy shapes. They can even look like stars. But this one is gonna be an acoustic guitar because I'm gonna draw a circle right there. Yeah, and then, yeah, the, the reverberation from the strings goes in here, and reverberates, and that's what you hear. Okay, and now let's draw a long rectangle right there. That's the bridge. Whoa, and right here is the neck. Whoa, it's so long. And then up here, whoop, let's draw an oval, just like that, and six pegs. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, those tighten and loosen, and that is what you tune the guitar with. And then what's it missing? What do you strum? Yeah, strings. We need six strings because it's a guitar. So first, let's go right here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Whoa, what a great guitar. Whoa, shall I try playing the guitar again? Yeah, cue that music. Yeah, that was so much fun learning to draw with you and playing this radical guitar. Whoa, if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> Here we go. B-L-I. P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. It's me, Blippi. Are you ready to draw with me? Yeah! Today, let's draw a shield. Not just any shield, Arpo shield! Yeah, Arpo is a robot babysitter that takes care of a little boy named Daniel. Okay, to draw Arpo shield, let's draw two big circles. Yeah, one, then one right here, just inside that other one. Whoa! There we go! And now we need an A. A for Arpo. Okay, let's go like this. Wee! And then arch down like that. Whoa! Now over here, now up. Whoa! Now we need to follow that line. There we go! Whoa! And last but not least, we need to draw a big yellow circle, just like that. Wow, that looks really good. That was so much fun drawing with you. If you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Blippi.
so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi. And do you like to draw? Yeah, I do too. And I have a fun thing for us to draw. Today, let's draw a duck. Not just any duck. Let's draw Declan the duck. Wow, what a cool duck. Ducks I really like because they quack. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> yeah, and their feet? Yeah, they have webbed feet so they can swim super fast. Okay, I'm gonna start with the color orange so then I can draw his beak. All right, here we go. Let's draw a line right here. Whoa, 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 just like that. And then let's draw, yeah, an arch line like that. And that is his beak. <laughs> yeah, his beak is the color orange. Ooh, and then for his head, whoa, nice big head. Ooh, and a nice little cheek right there. There we go. And let's draw his eyes, half circle, and a half circle within the half circle. And then his pupils, there we go. Let's color him in, just like that. Whoa, cute duck. All right, let's draw his neck. And then his body, wow, his body is so big. <laughs> yeah, it looks like he's floating on the water already, right? And then let's draw a cute little tail. Yeah, the tail is a feather. One big feather. Oh, and then his wing right here. Oh, and then let's take orange again and draw his legs. Okay, one leg right here, one leg right there. And then for his feet, one, two, three lines, just like that. There we go. Whoa, what cute feet. Oh, did you know ducks don't float on top of the water by paddling their feet? Yeah, it's actually trapping air bubbles within their wings and it keeps them nice and buoyant. Whoa, I love ducks. Hey, and I really enjoy drawing this duck with you. If you wanna draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Quack, 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 quack. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun Blippi, Blippi So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout Blippi, so much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout Blippi Hey, it's me Blippi Have you ever been to a playground before? I know, they're so much fun They have slides that you can slide down They have swings that you can swing on Ooh, and they even have seesaws. Whoa, have you ever ridden a seesaw before? They're so much fun. I love riding seesaws, especially with my best friend Mika. Wait a second, why don't we draw a seesaw together? All right, first I'm gonna draw a very tall half of a oval, just like that. Whoa, and then we'll draw a circle right up top. And that is where you balance at. And then someone's gonna be way up top, right up here. And that's gonna be a very long rectangle. And then someone will be at the very bottom down here. And that board is gonna be nice and strong. And what do you hold on to? Yeah, handles. So let's draw the letter T, just like that. Whoa, way up high, so scary, but so fun. All right, hold on tight so you're nice and safe. Whoa! If you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Blippi, come on everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. Rawr. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. I was just acting like a lion. Yeah, lions are just very big cats. Yeah, do you know someone with a cat as a pet? Yeah, a house cat? But lions are way bigger. And lions even have a mane, the male lions. I have an idea. Why don't we draw a lion together? All right, I'm going to take the color brown and draw a big poof. Yeah, look at this. Doesn't it kind of look like a cloud? Whoa! But actually, that's going to be the lion's mane. Yeah! And check this out. Let's draw a half circle up here, a half circle up there, 
Ooh, there we go. Do you know what those are? Yeah, it's gonna be the ears. Check this out. Let's draw a circle right there, a circle right there, and look at that. Whoa, doesn't it look like a happy cloud? Well, this actually isn't the smile. That is its jawline. So fierce. All right, so let's go like this. Whoa, whoa. Color that in real quick. And that's gonna be the lion's nose. And actually, lions can smell really well. And what they can also do really well is roar. They can roar so loud, you can hear it so far away. Okay, and check this out. Whoop, whoop. There we go. Whoa. Now, does that look like a lion? Yeah, a very cute lion. Wow, it looks so fluffy, right? I know! Wow, if you love drawing with me and had so much fun drawing a lion and want to draw more together, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. All right. See you again. Bye bye. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. It's me, Blippi. Do you want to draw a mouse with me? Yeah! Mice are so cute. Yeah, they're actually rodents, and they're very soft, but you probably don't want to touch them. Unless it's your pet, then you can. <laughs> All right, so to draw a mouse, let's draw an upside down raindrop. So let's start with a point right here. Whoa, there we go. Yeah, that's going to be the mouse's head. Okay, let's do a nice small circle right there and there for their small beady little eyes. And then let's draw a oval. There we go. And that's its body, just like that. And let's draw a circle right here, a circle right there. Yeah, and then those are the mice's hands. And then a small circle down here, small circle right there. And that, yeah, mice's feet. There we go. Perfect. And then what does every mouse have? On its back? Lower? Yeah! A tail! Whoa! Wee! There we go. And then I'm actually gonna make more detailed and go right next to it. Just like that. There we go. Whoa! And then let's actually draw some whiskers. Straight, long, curved lines. There we go. Perfect. Whoa, now that's a cool looking mouse. Then let's take some pink right here, and then there we go, on its snout. Whoa, and mice actually eat a lot of things. Yeah, plant and animal matter. That means it's an omnivore. So let's actually draw a piece of cheese. There we go, an upside down triangle, just like that. You can draw some circles in it. Whoa, doesn't that look yummy? I know, and how about on top of its head, right up here. Two small little ears. Yeah, 
Just kidding, they're big. <laughs> yeah, I said small, but they're actually massive. You know, mice have big ears. They could probably hear really well. There we go. Whoa, now is that a cute mouse or is that a cute mouse? <laughs> I know. Wow, if you had a great time drawing a mouse with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi! Do you know who my best friend in the whole entire world is other than you? Yeah, Mika! And today, you and I can draw Mika's headband! Wow, you know how I wear a hat? She wears a headband! All right, I'm gonna take the color black and draw a bow tie. Yeah, just like this. Oh, I like bow ties. Obviously. <laughs> and then we'll go up here like that. Whoa. And then we'll draw a big circle. And then we'll draw another one. Whoa. Doesn't that look like a bow tie that goes around her head? Yeah. And we can draw some lines to give it some texture. Yeah. Like it's wrinkles. And then what color is her headband? Yeah. Yellow. All right. Let's draw some yellow. Woohoo. Coloring, coloring, I'm coloring some yellow. Woohoo! There we go. Wow, I love Mika's headband. And I love Mika. What a great friend. And what a great friend to you. If you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B L I P P I. Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye bye. Blippi. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. And I was just acting like a dog. Hey, why don't you and I draw a dog together? Yeah. All right, first we need to draw six circles on the bottom. Will you count with me? One, two, three, four, five, six. Good job. And now two half circles, one right there. Whoa, and a bigger one right there. Whoa. Let's draw two eyes. Yeah, two circles that we color in, just like that. And then let's fill this area in for the nose. And we can't forget about the whiskers. Those are just dots, just like that. Oh, and let's make a little tongue. Ah. <laughs> okay, let's draw some ovals for some ears, just like that. And then we need to draw the tail. Whoa, look at that long point. And to finish it up, let's draw some straight lines for the feet. Oh, cool. Did you like drawing the dog with me? Yeah, that was fun. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Do you see what I'm wearing? Yeah, my blue shirt. Ooh, and my orange suspenders. Oh, and check it out, my hat, and what's this? Yeah, my orange bow tie. Maybe you and I can draw my bow tie. I love wearing my bow tie because it's one of my two favorite colors. What is it? Yeah, orange. Then my other favorite color? Yeah, blue. All right, to draw my bow tie, we need to draw a circle right in the middle. Oh, and then we need to draw this big, looks kind of like a triangle, but it doesn't connect. <laughs> and then over here, we'll do the same. All right, whoa, starting to look like my bow tie, right? Okay, so now let's draw a very thin oval and one right here. Wow, and that kind of looks like it's wrinkled, right? 
Yeah, see? Oh, now that looks like my bow tie. Whoa, that was so much fun drawing with you. Wow, if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. All right, will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. -P -P all right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning. to learn about it'll make you want to shout Blippi hey it's me Blippi and I would love to draw something with you how about a computer yeah a computer is a machine that you can work on whoa sending emails or maybe you could even edit and make a video <laughs> awesome all right to draw a computer I'm gonna grab my black marker and draw a rectangle up here Whoa, look at that rectangle. And then I'm gonna draw a rectangle inside the rectangle for the screen. Whoa, check that out. And then I'm gonna draw a really wide base rectangle. Wait a second, that looks like a trapezoid. Whoa, let's draw some lines like this. Whoa, and then some horizontal lines. Yeah, now that looks like the keyboard. Whoa, computers are awesome. And maybe on the screen, you're watching a video of a heart. Wow, cool. <laughs> wow, I love drawing. And if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. See you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning. To learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi! And today, you and I are gonna draw a bee! Bzz. Not just any bee, bee from Lullaby City Farm! Whoa! Bees are very important for our environment and pollination! Alright, to draw a bee, I'm gonna take blue and draw a circle for the head. Ooh, an arched line for the body. Ooh, and some more curved lines for the wings. There we go. And can't forget about the cute legs. Ooh, and two arms. There we go. <laughs> wow. All right, let's draw some circles for the eyes like that. Whoa, there we go. <laughs> it's starting to look like B, right? And then some suspenders. There we go. Yeah, for the overalls. Cool. And B actually has stripes, just like a regular B. There we go. <laughs> and then let's draw a big smile, just like that. And you can't forget about the antennas. There we go. <laughs> all right. If you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. All right. See you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make the It'll make you want to shout Blippi! So much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! Hey! It's me, Blippi. And do you like to draw? I do too! And today, you and I are going to draw a sheep. Okay, I'm going to take this black marker and draw an oval, just like that. And then I'm going to draw two circles for the eyes. And did you know sheep? Yeah, they're pupils. They're actually rectangles. So then I'm going to draw two rectangles, just like that. And then I'll draw an arched line and two little dots. All right, now for the body. Yeah, the big fluffy body. Whoa, look at that. Doesn't it look soft? I know. All right, and then draw four legs, just like that. Whoa! And now, two droopy ears. Wee! And then one on this side. Whoa! Isn't that cute? Yeah, let's add some more softness to the top of its head. Wow! So soft. Yeah, sheep are so cool. They actually have a very good sense of smell. And they even use it to communicate with each other sometimes. Whoa! Wasn't this fun drawing the sheep together? 
know. Well, if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi. It's me, Blippi. Do you like to draw? I do too. Let's draw an animal together. Okay, you can guess what animal it is. It's really tall, has a really long neck. Yeah, and they live in Africa. <gasps> yeah, a giraffe. Let's draw a giraffe together. First, let's draw the head. Ooh, there we go. Two little ears, just like that. Oh, and then on top, they have these things called Aussie cones. Yeah, they kind of look like horns, but they're a lot cuter. <laughs> All right, two small eyes. There we go. And then two nostrils and then a smiley face. Nose, mouth, and eyes. All right, now let's draw the really long neck. <laughs> yeah, there we go. And then there's the body. Oh, and then it has four legs. <laughs> there we go. And then the feet. Perfect. And the tail. Whoa. Oh, and you can't forget about all the spots. Just like that. Oh, there we go. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Wasn't this so much fun drawing a draft together? Yeah. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P I. Flippy! All right, see you again. Bye bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Flippy! Yo, what's up? It's me, Flippy. Check out my tight skateboard. Cool, right? I know. <laughs> hey, today, why don't you and I draw a skateboard? Oh, skateboards are so fun. I'll start with the color orange. Yeah, it's a piece of wood on four wheels. Oh, so to draw a piece of wood, let's go like this, because it goes up a little, and then all the way across, and then it goes up. Oh, and then let's do a little loop, just like that. And that is what you stand on. And then we need to draw the wheels. Okay, let's go right here. One right there, one right there. So that's one, two, and then there's two more on the other side. Just like that, and just like that. Whoa! Wow, skateboarding is so much fun. It's so fun to be active. Yeah. Well, if you enjoy drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout Blippi. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And I have a great idea what we could draw today. Let's draw an animal. A really big animal. It's the third largest living land animal today. Yeah, it's a hippopotamus. Oh, what a silly name, hippopotamus. You can just call him a hippo. <laughs> All right, let's see. Hippos are really big. So let's draw it an oval. Yeah, for its mouth area. Ooh, and then half circle for its head. Ooh, and let, let's draw two small circles for the eyes. Ooh, and then two little cute ears. There we go. Ooh, and two dots for the nose little smiley face and a really big body because they're so big. Ooh, and then there's one back leg and another back leg. Kind of looks like a rectangle. Big belly and then two rectangles up here for the legs. But you can't forget about the tail. There we go. There we go. Hey, hippo. <laughs> well, if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P I Blippy. All right, see you again. Bye bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Blippy. Ah. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippy. Ah. <laughs> I was just.
just acting like a dinosaur. Yeah, maybe like a T-Rex. <sighs> or a Triceratops, or a Stegosaurus. Wow, dinosaurs are so cool. They used to live on our planet millions of years ago. I have an idea, why don't we draw a dinosaur footprint? All right, here we go. Whoa, lots of curved lines, like this. Whoa, and dinosaur footprints, yeah, are a great way to tell to see how big the dinosaurs were, or maybe what they ate. Yeah, since I'm using a brown marker, it kind of looks like it got its footprint in mud, right? Yeah, now let's draw some triangles. Whoa, yeah, that's where the claws touch the ground. Wow, doesn't that look cool? Whoa, what a great way to learn about dinosaurs. Whoa, I sure do love drawing with you. And if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Blippi, come on everyone, let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi, so much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Blippi, so much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Blippi. Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi, and do you like to draw? I do too! I have a great idea. Why don't we draw something together? Yeah! Well, what should we draw? Oh, a mermaid! That sounds pretty fun. I love mermaids. I've never seen one in real life, but they're pretty cool. Yeah, it's half human, half fish. What else could you ask for? <laughs> Not a whole lot. <laughs> All right, let's draw the body, which is, yeah, half fish. All right, let's go like that and do an Arc line like that. Whoa, yeah! And then for the tail. There we go. Whoa! I bet this mermaid can swim super fast. Okay, now let's draw the human part. Yeah, here we go. Let's just do a little thing like that. So then we show a little section between the fish and the human. And then we need the shoulders of the mermaid. Oh, let's go in just a little bit more for the neck. And then a big circle for the head. Whoa! And then two small circles for the eyes. That big smiley face. Yeah, because she's so happy to be a mermaid. Whoa! And then let's go like this for the hair. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, there we go. Whoa! What a beautiful mermaid! And then let's draw some fins for the arms. There we go! Whoa, what a beautiful mermaid! She's just hanging out in the water, swimming around, enjoying life. <laughs> well, if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> Will you spell my name with me? Yeah! Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye! come on everyone, let's make learning It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Whoa! Hey, it's me, Blippi! And look at what I have right here. Yeah! A T-Rex Ranch Park Ranger patch! Whoa! All the park rangers at T-Rex Ranch have these. They're so cool! So cool because it has a T-Rex skull on it. Hey, why don't you and I draw this patch together? That sounds like fun! Okay, I'm going to start with the color green, and I'm actually going to draw all the way around. Yeah, with these squiggly, rounded lines like this. Whoa, there we go. Yeah, now I have an area for the skull. Okay, I'll actually keep the green and make the skull. So let's start back here, and you draw the top of the skull. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa. Yeah, the line doesn't actually have to be that straight because it's actually a dinosaur bone. Yeah, fossilized dinosaur bone. There we go. That kind of looks like the top of the skull. And then let's go down here and we need to make the mouth right here. See that? Whoa. And let's loop back. Whoa. 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 Perfect. Whoa. Doesn't that look like a skull? Yeah. Now let's draw an eye up here. Let's color it in and try and leave a little bit of white, okay? There we go, just like that. 
And then we'll add some detail. Whoa. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it gives it just a little bit of texture. We could even do that on bottom just a little bit. Whoa, perfect. And what's it missing right here? Teeth, big, sharp teeth. Because this is a T-Rex skull, it has big teeth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now a bunch of small teeth. There we go. Yeah, right on bottom. Small teeth on bottom, big up top. There we go. Whoa. And then it says T-Rex Ranch. So I'm actually gonna take the color black and write that. Okay, T-Rex Ranch. There we go. T-Rex Ranch. Whoa, that was so much fun drawing with you. And I sure do love dinosaurs. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Oh, can't forget this. Hey, 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 it's me, Flippy. And do you like to draw? Yeah, I do too. Why don't we draw an animal? Have you seen an animal around here lately? A snake? Right here? Whoa, you're right. Hey, snake. Wow, I love snakes. Yeah, they're reptiles. They just slither around. Whoa, I'm going to take the color green and draw a snake. So what I'm going to do is do a squiggly line. All right, start over here. Whoa, whoa. And then I'll make a point right here for the tail. Wee! And then just follow that squiggly line back. There we go. Yeah, and then I'll make a nice little head like that. And then we'll do an eye and a smile. And then, what do they have right here? Yeah, a tongue. Let's go like this. Yeah, and did you know snakes actually smell with their tongue? Whoa, really cool. Now let's just draw some lines. Yeah, to make it nice and cute. Whoa, that was so much fun. If you love drawing and want to draw more with me, yeah, like cool things like this, like the snake, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout Blippi. me Blippi. I was just brushing my teeth with this giant toothbrush. Oh, have you ever brushed your teeth? Yeah, it's very important to keep your teeth nice and clean. Hey, why don't we draw a toothbrush together? Oh, since toothbrushes can be in many different colors, I'm gonna draw a green one today. Okay, let's draw two straight lines. Whoa, right next to each other. See, one, two. Then let's connect them just like that, and that's the handle. And then let's draw a rectangle. Yeah, and those are the bristles. You just have to draw a lot of lines because there's a lot of bristles. Whoa, and what's this toothbrush missing? Yeah, toothpaste. Whoa, I'm gonna draw some purple toothpaste. Okay, let's start right here, do a curve, Ooh, and then let's make a point right up there. Whoa, that's a lot of toothpaste. Actually, all you need is just a pea-sized amount. Whoa, that was so much fun drawing a toothbrush with you. And remember, you can brush your teeth twice a day. And it's really good for your mouth to keep it nice and clean. Well, if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Flippy. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Flippy. Flippy. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Flippy. Hey, it's me, Flippy. Are you excited to draw with me? Yeah, I am too. And today, you and I are going to draw a fruit. Yeah, not a vegetable, a fruit. Hey, and will you guess what fruit it is? I'll describe it to you. It's a big fruit. It's circular. Yeah, nice and round. It's very heavy. It's green on the outside, but when you cut it open on the inside, what you eat is the color red. Mm, 
Yum, yeah, it's a watermelon. Not just any watermelon, it's a cocoa melon watermelon. Are you excited? Yeah, let's draw. Okay, first I'm gonna take the color green and draw a big circle. Woohoo! There we go, just like that. Whoa, perfect! And then on the inside, we're gonna draw a square with rounded edges. Yeah, and that's a TV. There we go. Whoa, 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 yeah! And now let's draw some watermelon lines. Whoa, yeah! There we go, perfect. Whoa, yeah! Wow, now it's looking like a watermelon, right? Okay, I'm gonna take the color black though next, and then I'm gonna draw the top. Yeah, the antennas. Draw a half circle just like that, and then whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah, there we go. Whoa, small little circles just like that. And then what about for the face right here? Yeah, two big eyes. One circle right there. There we go. Oh, fill it in with the color black. So then this watermelon can see. <laughs> and there's another one right there. <laughs> okay, what are we missing right here? Right here. Yeah? Okay, the nose. Boop. And then a big smile. Whoa! Yeah, that definitely looks like the Coco Melon Watermelon. Wow! Did you have fun drawing with me? Yeah, I had fun drawing with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi. Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi. And did you see that? Yeah, a dump truck. That's exactly what we're gonna draw today, a dump truck. All right, I love dump trucks because they can carry such heavy loads, so many materials. Yeah, maybe sand, rocks, gravel, who knows? <laughs> All right, to draw a dump truck, first we need to start with the cab. Okay, right here, yeah, the cabin, that's where the operator, the driver of the dump truck sits. And then let's go like this, yeah, to make some room for the wheels and tires later. But let's go straight across like that. Another one right there. Whoa, and up right here. Whoop, whew, and all the way over. Yeah, and now we should probably draw a windshield right there. Whoa, and the door. <laughs> there we go. Wow, starting to look like a dump truck, right? Yeah, what does it have way back here? Yeah, the bed. Whoa, so let's draw a straight line that goes diagonal. Whoop, just like that. And then we'll go like this, another straight line, and then down. Wait a second, what does that look like? What shape? Yeah, a rectangle. Whoa, cool. And then we're missing a couple things. The wheels and tires, yeah. And the hydraulic lift right there. Yeah, let's draw that hydraulic lift. First, let's draw a straight line all the way down, and then a line right next to it, parallel with that one. Perfect, yeah, that's what extends and pushes the bed so then all the material can dump out. And then let's draw a tire. Wow, that's the outside circle. The tire makes it so it doesn't slip and slide. And this one right over here, another tire. And then if we go like this, yeah, another circle. That's the wheel, cool. Now we can go like this. Like it's dumping things out of the bed. Wow, what a useful machine. Whoa, there we go. Wow, this is probably a bunch of gravel. Maybe they're making a gravel driveway. Wow, well that was so much fun drawing a dump truck with you. If you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. There we go, see you again, bye-bye. <laughs> Come on everyone, let's make learning fun So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi! Hey, it's me Blippi! Have you ever been outside when it's raining? Yeah! What do you hold in your hand? 
Yeah, an umbrella, so then you don't get all wet. Why don't we draw an umbrella together? First, we have to draw a big half circle. Whoa, and then three smaller half circles the other way. There we go, and then we need to draw a letter J. Yeah, just like that, for the handle. Doesn't that look like the letter J? <laughs> I know, and then if we draw lines like this, yeah, it has little sections that we can color it in and make a very colorful umbrella. So let's add some red right there. Whoa! Let's add some green. Whoa! There we go. And let's add some blue. Whoa! Now that's a colorful umbrella. Whoa! If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Do you want to know a fruit that is very healthy that Mika loves? Yeah, a tomato. Today, you and I are going to draw a tomato. First, I'm going to start with the color green. Yeah, for the leaves and stem. All right, let's draw an arch like this. Ooh, and let's draw some, whoa, pointy things. Whoa, there we go. And then the stem. Whoa! So we have leaves in the stem. And then what color are tomatoes? Yeah, red. All right, now let's draw a big circle. Wow, now it's starting to look like a tomato, right? I know. <laughs> All right, let's draw some wide eyes. Whoa, and a very wide mouth. Whoa, what a cute tomato. He's so happy. He's probably happy because he's very healthy. Whoa. All right, well, if you want to draw more with me, yeah, more really fun things like this, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Make learning fun, Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi, and look at what's in my hand. Ooh, a penguin stuffed animal. Hello! Wow, I love penguins. They are so cute. Yeah, they're the colors black and white. Whoa, and their beaks and feet, they're orange. And how about you and I? We could draw a penguin together. Wow, that sounds like fun. Okay, I'm gonna take this black marker and draw a circle for the head. Whoa, perfect, just like that. And then a big oval for the body, okay? Wee! yeah, perfect. And then let's draw two small circles right there for the eyes, just like that. And then we'll go like this. Whoa, kind of like a heart shape. Yeah, for his face. And then let's draw some flippers. Whoa! Well, actually, they're wings. Yeah, but they act as flippers. They can swim super fast with them. Yeah, penguins can swim so fast, and they can hold their breath for a very long time. Whoa! Okay, now let's take the color orange. Whoa! And let's draw the beak. Okay, let's go like this, whoop. Yeah, two arched lines like that. And then we'll go like this, whoop. Yeah, that looks like a beak, right? And then now for the feet. Let's do some curved lines, whee, like that. Whoa, they actually have webbed feet. Whoa, 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 kind of like a duck. Yeah, they can just flip around, whoop, 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 whoop. And have you ever seen a penguin move? Yeah, do they sprint whoosh, so fast? No, they don't. What they do is waddle. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> and actually, penguins, did you know, can't fly? Yeah, they can't fly. They can just swim super fast. <laughs> wow, that was so much fun drawing a penguin with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P 
P-P-I. Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Flippy. It's me, Flippy, and today you and I are gonna draw a dinosaur. A dinosaur with plates on its back and spikes on its tail. Yeah, you guessed it, a stegosaurus. All right, to draw a stegosaurus, let's draw a curved line for its back. Ooh, and then a curved line for its tail, just like that. And then let's go down and draw four legs because stegosaurus had four legs. <laughs> and then a straight line for the body Two more legs to complete the four, and then, yeah, some curved lines for the head. Whoa, can't forget about the circle for the eye, and little smiley face. Yeah, but what's it missing? Yeah, the plates. And every stegosaurus had 17 or more plates. So, will you count 17 with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Cool. All right. That was so much fun drawing the stegosaurus with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P I. Flippy. See you later, red stegosaurus. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make learning. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi! And do you want to draw something else with me? Yeah! Let's draw the night sky! Wow! At nighttime, is there the sun or the moon? Yeah, the moon! So let's act like we're drawing a circle, but let's stop halfway. And then, let's arch it back the same way. Yeah, that looks like the moon, doesn't it? Yeah, the moon actually can look different. Yeah, at different times of the month. Yeah, because light hits it in different ways. Oh, hey, and what else is in the night sky? Yeah, stars. Let's draw some orange stars. There we go. Wow, this is perfect. I love the nighttime. Oh, it's so relaxing. And look, my two favorite colors, blue and orange. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. And if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi. See you later. Bye-bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. I'll be right there. I'm almost there. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, it's me, Blippi. I was running a bit late. Oh, that's a great idea. Why don't we draw a clock together? Okay, let me take the color black. Yeah, and draw a big circle. There we go. All right, and then let's draw a small circle right in the middle. Whoa, it kind of looks like an eyeball, but we're drawing a clock. All right, to draw a clock, we need to write the numbers one through 12 around the whole thing. So here we go. Let's one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. There we go. And there's two hands. Yeah, the shorter hand is to tell what hour it is. And the longer hand is to tell what minute it is. Let's draw the shorter hand pointing to the number 12. Let's draw a long one pointing to the number three. It's 12, 15. Whoa, great. Well, I sure do love drawing with you. And if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. <laughs> Make learning fun blippy, blippy, blippy. So much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi So much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi Hey, it's me, Blippi Are you ready to draw a kite with me? This is going to be so much fun To draw a kite, there's many different shapes But you and I are going to draw a diamond-shaped kite 
Okay, I'm gonna take the color red. You can use any color you want because kites are so colorful. And let's draw a diamond. See those four sides? Just like that. And then I'm gonna take the color blue and draw a vertical line, just like that. And then a horizontal line. And I'm gonna take a new color, the color green, and make a tail. Woohoo! Yeah! You know how some have really long tails? Yeah, that just fly in the wind. Whoa! And then I'm gonna take the color black. And what do you hold on to? Yeah, you hold on to a handle, and that handle has a very long string. And when the kite is so high in the air, yeah, you're holding on to it. Woohoo! So let's draw that string. Woohoo! Yeah, all the way down to the ground with the handle. There we go. Wow, that was so much fun drawing with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I. P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout.